Hey everyone, welcome back to Engineering Education. For this next video, we are going to continue with power, and this video is related to horsepower. So let's say that we have a three phase motor whose input, V line, is 240 volts, the power in is 10 kilowatts, the efficiency of the motor is 80% and the power factor is given as 80% lagging. Here we are asked to find the output of the motor in horsepower and find the magnitude of the input line current. So as always, pause the video, give it a shot, and we'll go over the answer in a bit. So to go about solving this, we can go to the FE handbook. And in the FE handbook, in the conversion factors section, we have the relationship between horsepower and watts and that's given right here so one horsepower is equal to roughly 746 watts so we'll need that to solve the problem one horsepower equals roughly 746 watts and so what we want to do is we want to find the output power of this motor or sometimes called the rated power. And the way we would do that is we need the definition of efficiency in terms of power. So efficiency is equal to power out divided by power in. All right, so the relationship between the output power and the input power. And we're given what the input power is, 10 kilowatts. And so we can rearrange this equation here as power out is equal to the efficiency times power in. And we can plug in the numbers there, 80% times, times the input power, 10 kilowatts. And that gives us 8 kilowatts. And so what we want to do is we want to turn that 8 kilowatts into horsepower. And so the way we'll do that is that's 8 kilowatts divided by 746, which gives us about 10.7 horsepower. So that's the answer to the first part. And to find the input line current, let's start off with the definition of power factor. So power factor, as you recall from last videos, is equal to the real power or the true power divided by the apparent power. And what is apparent power? Apparent power is what appears to be in the system. So that's going to be the square root of 3 times V line times I line. And this is P here. And so we can rearrange this formula here to solve for the line current IL. And that comes out to P over B square root of 3 VL times power factor. And so I line is your input current, VL is your input voltage, and so therefore P has to be your input power. And then we can plug those in. Input power is given as 10 kilowatts divided by the square root of 3. V line is 240. Power factor is 0 0.8. And when we plug all that in, we get about 30.1 amps. And so these are our answers here, 10.7 horsepower and 30.1 amps. Now, some of the important things to keep in mind is that we were given input power. And if we were given, let's say, rated power or output power, then this formula for IL changes a little bit, where we saw before that PN is equal to P out divided by efficiency. So in the in the cases where they give you you know output power or rated power or nameplate power, that 
is equivalent to the output power and P in becomes P out over efficiency, which simply would just mean that IL would be your rated power divided by the square root of three, V line, power factor, and then multiply that by efficiency. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I hope you guys found it valuable. If there's anything that you'd like me to go over or explain again, please let me know in the comments below. If you enjoyed the video, please give it a thumbs up, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Until then, enjoy engineering.